Welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast Show. It's Expresso here on SABC3. Now, Christmas is around the corner and soon the shopping frenzy will begin. But when you buy a gift for someone, how, how about adding that personal touch, that thing that just makes it so much more special? And of course, our art director, Matana Katz, has the details on how we can do just that. Matana, how are you? I like this personalized thing because it just, it just makes it feel so much more special, like it was thought out and it really does... It goes the extra mile, right? It really does. And awesome. you know what I, what I love about it is that when you spend time on a gift for someone and you give them something really special, yeah. and then adding a personal touch, people really appreciate it. I know. And I also feel like when you start, you know, putting more time and effort into gifts for people and your family and your friends, um, they start reciprocating as well. And True. it becomes a really nice kind of trend to start with each other, that it's not just about buying something, exactly. wrapping, giving it up. It's about actually spending time on it and making it personalized. And here's the thing, the chance of it being re-gifted <laughs> so much less. No one's going to re a personalized <laughs> gift. I mean, they on. can't. They, they, really, they really, really can't. So that's a win-win. Awesome. I know, definitely. So what are we doing today, though? So we're going to be making um, a beautiful crystal decanter top. Um, as you can see here, uh, we've played with a few different um, precious semi-stones. I love it. Uh, rose quartz and amethyst. Okay. And what's really great is, surprisingly, these are actually very affordable yeah. um, stones to get. They're Seriously. not exorbitant. Um, they're very affordable, and they look really beautiful. I love it. It's taken this decanter to a whole nother level. It really does. How do we create it though? Okay, so let's go through what we'd need for this craft. All right. So um, some recycled corks, mm -hmm. um, some semi-precious stones of your yeah. choice. You can go into any kind of uh, your local stone or precious semi-stone stone shop yeah. and buy a whole lot um, of different ones. When you're buying, try look for ones that have um, flat edges so that it's okay. easy to stick onto the cork. Um, and then you just need some super glue, some newspaper. And then I also to always try to use a nice big sturdy book or any kind of surface just to lean them up against because you don't want them to fall down. Of course, yeah. So we're actually going to make some right now. Fantastic. So we can each choose our rose quartz. So I thought that would be quite nice for you. That's a nice one and it's got a flat there. top over there. Exactly. Very nice. And then I will do, this one's very nice. It's got a really nice flat yeah, top cool. as well. Okay, okay so literally um, we each have a cork. I'm going to, you can open up this and you can literally start squeezing and putting super glue all over the top of the cork. Okay. Okay. And we know when we're working with super glue, you always has to have to be careful as well, especially with children are concerned because if they get hold of it, problems. Exactly. A good trick for super glue, getting it off your fingers, yeah. is to use um, nail polish remover. It works like a charm. Are you kidding me? Uh, no, I'm dead serious. It really, really works Matana, so well. where have you been all my life? <laughs> Man. Okay, so we're going to put the stones already kind of propped up over here. Okay. Take our cork with our glue on it. Great. And we literally just put it on top. So it's so lightweight that it actually just uh, holds and stays. So I got some. I knew I would. We will clean that up. <laughs> we will clean that up. And there we go. Just like that. Exactly. Easy, yeah? but you'll leave it to dry. <laughs> so we can then put it down there we go. and then as I will take it perfectly there and I'll put it down for you and as you can see the finished product over there on the Ta -da! crystal decanters so beautiful so easy um, and you can really have fun with that you can play different colors different types of stones and you can really make it your own and I think your your friend or your family member will really appreciate the extra thought I mean any guest that walks into a home once they've seen this is gonna be like wow this is so different it's so cute it's so personalized well exactly. done Matana thank you Lee. I really really love it this looks so good well if you are thinking of something to make for Christmas then this could possibly be a great idea and I promise no one else anywhere is going to have it except you and that's what's going to make it so amazing. Matana, you're awesome. I'm so glad Thank that you. we have you here with us <laughs> as we talk about great gifts for our families over the next few weeks. Thank you, Lee. Fun dusties. Now, of course, someone that's just as fantastic is David Lally. He did us so proud at uh, New York Fashion Week. He just completely is taking the world by storm, but he did even better at Africa Fashion Week with his Spring Summer 2015 collection. Here is your front row seat.